Okay, guys. So Neutrogena Micro Mist Airbrush Sunless Spray Deep Intense Number Three Up to Three Shades Darker Ultra Light Fine Mist Goes On Evenly and Works at Any Angle. Ooh, All Over Flawless Tan No Rubbing Application. Okay, let's spray this on. Okay, guys. So I just got out of the shower. I want you to look how ghostly 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 white my legs are do you see that like, my arms are so much darker than my legs because i never wear shorts don't like how i look in shorts i never wear shorts but this is ridiculously white and azumi and i are going to go play tennis so i thought i would try the product that i just showed you on my leg and see i'm only going to do it on one leg and see if it makes a difference or not did it make a difference in one application am i darker am i more tanned am i more even i don't know let's go ahead and just try it okay so i'm going to shake it up right you guys can see what we are using now let's try this leg this one would be the easiest you can see everything right there see how it goes on make sure i shake it up well i never have luck with these things Don't forget to do your feet. That's it. Let's give it a few minutes to dry. I will say that the fragrance of this, that the fragrance is not bad at all. It's like a light between a hairspray and a perfume. Doesn't smell bad at all. I can feel that it's wet. So we're going to give it a few minutes to dry. Okay, so I'm reading this and it says that it will develop, the tan will develop within two to four hours and it will last for days. So obviously we're going to have to go play tennis and I'm going to have to check back in with you guys in two to four hours. Okay guys, so I brought you outside so you can see what it looks like in daylight. Um, right now we're in the shade, I'm talking to you in the shade so the, the camera quality is clear. I can personally see a difference in my, in, my, in my legs. Like the one that I did looks, the one that I sprayed, looks so natural, but it looks just a little bit darker than my actual skin color. Um, I'm going to spray on another coat tomorrow and see how much darker it will get. But for now, I thought I would bring you guys outside. I would step back in the direct lighting over there and show you guys what it looks like in the actual daylight. Maybe this is a better comparison, even though the lighting is super, super bright. Can you tell which one I did? I don't know. I'm going to have to review this footage later. I did this one. I thought I would show you guys in a different lighting. Let me zoom in. I think that's a big difference. Okay, guys, day two. I actually saw a significant difference in my legs. Let me turn, let me scoot back here. Now, I don't know if you can so much tell it on camera, so I took as many photos as I could to show you the biggest difference. I think you can tell. I think you can. That This one is so much more tan, but it took six hours. It didn't take four hours. I think it said here, how many hours did it say? It says two to four hours. This one took about six hours on my skin to actually like fully develop. So we're going to do another coat today on this leg and see. If I'm talking funny, it's because I bit my tongue. I have a cut on my tongue. Um, but, yeah, we're going to try this leg right now with the second coat and see how it looks. So, we're going to shake it up and do the exact same thing we did yesterday. But, I will tell you one thing. Like, this looks so much better. Like, so much more. more uh, it looks more tanned. But, it also, look, see, it matches my arm now which is freaking amazing versus, I don't know if you guys can tell at that distance, this does not match my arm. My forearm to my leg, nope, does not match. And that matches. So let's go ahead and try this one.
You know what? I just noticed because my shorts were longer yesterday and I didn't come up this far. I'm going to get the camera close and show you guys. Or maybe you can see right there. Let me get a little closer. Can you tell that there's a line of the spray tan where it wasn't sprayed? Let me get the camera closer. So look, I know you can see it now. So there's a line. So I sprayed down here yesterday and I didn't spray here. And look at that. So it did tan me. I feel like you see it like more collected like right here and maybe right there a little bit. You can tell what I'm saying. Like it's not just a straight line. I mean, you see the line, but it's like a looks darker here and a little bit darker here. But nothing like tremendously different. Oh, well, actually, let's look at my calf here. So my calf, I haven't showered today. My calf looks like it has a little bit more of a deposit right there as well. Let's just see what it looks like with the second coat. So I'll check in with you guys in a few hours and let you know whether it did it, it whether it made it darker or it just stayed the same color, but or if it even rubs off. I don't know. Hey guys, so I see a significant difference. Let me show you. Can you guys tell? Let me put the camera down a little bit more. Can you guys tell the difference? This is super, super white. And that is nicely tanned in compare. Look at tanned, not tanned. And then I'm gonna take the camera and put it closer to my legs and go down my legs so you can see my legs. I think that's fantastic. Okay guys, so I think that my legs look, that leg looks really, really good. It looks very, very natural, honestly. Like you couldn't even tell. Now you know that expression that tan skinned looks more toned? Well, that is so true because I'm looking at my legs and I'm like, oh my gosh, you know, my leg looks like a more fit. It looks so super natural to me. Honestly, it's not, and, and like I was saying, I don't know if I had told you, but I turn orange all the time. I've never not turned orange and my leg does not look orange. It looks like a nice, it looks just like my arm, which is lovely. But we're going to be testing this out tomorrow because Zumi has a birthday party, a swimming pool birthday party at the Stratosphere Hotel tomorrow on the strip here in Las Vegas. And so obviously I'm going to be walking around in a bathing suit and going into the, to the pool and sitting down on the chairs and stuff like that. So does it actually hold up or will it just wash away? I don't know. I'm not going to spray my other leg. So it might be look weird to other people that have one leg that's white, one leg that's tanned. But this is an experiment and we're going to experience this together. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, so I, I'm here. We're here at the Stratosphere on Las Vegas Boulevard. I'm going to ask Lisa here what she thinks of my legs. So look at my legs. Let me check it out. Stand this up. Okay, I'm gonna stand up and she's gonna check out my legs. It has a, like a sun-kissed bronze, just a hint of color. Gives her a, just a little bit of a glow. Not spotty, not orangey, but just real nice with a little bit of a shimmer to it. So you think it looks natural? Very natural looking. And so this is the first time I've ever put a spray tan on that doesn't look orange. But you There's, couldn't tell unless I told you, right? No, I didn't. I didn't know. I just saw that it looked like a like a like a like a slight bronze, but it's it's so subtle. But you can see color. Yeah. You can see color in with a shimmer. It just gives you a healthy glow. And she agrees that it makes your legs look more firm. Toned. It helps tone the skin. It, it gives you a toned. Yep. So if you guys are looking to buy a house, you can contact my friend here, Lisa Sandoval at Realty One. Realty One. <laughs> I'll do the closing after today's activities. Yeah. Did you put the sunscreen on? I did. On your face too? No. Just on your arms. Yeah. Zumi, Zumi, smile. Rebecca, smile. <laughs> it looked like athletes like that. Like, <laughs> okay, smile. <laughs>
guys, so we just got back from the hotel not too long ago. I'm going to show you my legs and show you exactly what happened with the spray tan. You can see the difference still between the legs. This one still is tanned, but it's almost like in certain areas it became blotchy. Like there or maybe here a little bit. You guys can see this looks like a bruise, but I do not have a bruise there. And as I was putting my feet in the water, I got this line right here. So this part faded and this part stayed on, but the chlorine water, obviously, from when I would get my legs wet, made it a little bit blotchy. But look, it's overall still tanned. Okay guys, so we are at Chiboli Village here in Las Vegas in Summerlin, and we're gonna look at the lake, see if you see a difference. So can you tell, honey, which one is tan, which one is not? The one on the left, your left leg is what's looks more tan. tan this yeah, one? yep. Okay guys, so you can see it looks a little splotchy, but it doesn't look bad. It still makes my leg look like it's toned. Yeah. Right down, I don't know. Yep. That's it. I'm gonna go ahead and review the footage and we will see what my final thoughts are at the end. Hey guys, so I actually was reviewing the video footage and I see a big difference. I don't know if you guys see a huge difference. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it around and show you my legs in the indoors and see if you can see what I'm seeing in the sunlight. So here's a comparison of the legs. To me, it seems like a tremendous portion kind of came off right here. I still have that bruise looking shadow we get to the top of the leg. What do you guys think? I think it's still tanned overall. It's just that there's certain portions that came off. And it's interesting that it came off right here versus right here where it was in the water more yesterday. But what do you guys think? So honestly, guys, I still love this product. Honestly, I just would recommend not going swimming if, or getting your, or scrubbing your skin with like a loof or anything. When you shower, just kind of take the soap and wash it over the leg, but don't scrub it hard because I feel like it would come off because I, my legs were only in the water for maybe an hour and a half, two hours. And I started getting that line that showed where it started fading off. So I wouldn't recommend that. Um, that blotchy spot really doesn't bother me as much. It just kind of looks like a bruise. It's a little bit darker. <laughs>